A royal biographer has claimed the Duchess of Sussex may face a takedown plot by royal courtiers who could see her as a threat to the throne. Anna Pasternak, author of Princess Diana's autobiography, compared Meghan, 37, to Wallace Simpson, an American socialite whose relationship with the then King Edward VIII caused a constitutional crisis that led to his abdication. Anna, who is releasing a book on Wallace Simpson, even warned Meghan that Buckingham Palace advisers named the men in grey by Princess Diana could plan her downfall if they feel her and Harry's star rises too high. Speaking to S Magazine and the Sunday Express, she said, Meghan is like a grenade that's been thrown into this archaic system and there are explosions already going on which I think will continue. In a sense Meghan has rejuvenated the spirit of Wallace and I hope people take the view of her as a kind, witty, loyal and dignified person who unfairly became the most vilified woman in the world. Anna then revealed that she worried for Meghan and Harry, who she dubbed the people's prince like Edward. She added, I worry for Meghan and Harry. He's the people's prince as Edward was the people's king. I fear if Meghan and Harry's star rises too high that will be perceived as the courtier's princess Diana called men in grey as a threat to the heir. Anna concluded by advising Meghan to toe the line and support the monarch, warning her against trying to set the agenda. In December a royal expert has revealed that the Duchess of Sussex is facing something of a public backlash because she's putting herself out on a limb by trying to modernize the monarchy. Royal biographer Claudia Joseph appeared on the Victoria Derbyshire program on BBC Two to discuss the public reaction to the pregnant Duchess, and claimed that Kate Middleton received less of a backlash when she joined the royal family due to her quiet nature. Speaking alongside fashion designer Imal Fashionu and journalism professor Susanna Franks, the panel dissected just why Meghan, 37, is subject to negative rumors that she's been rude to staff and cut off friends who are no longer useful. While Amal argued that her race and background have seen her being treated differently to Kate, Susanna claimed that her more vigorous approach to the role of Duchess is the reason she's courted more controversy. The same month Tom Bauer, an authorized biographer of Prince Charles, spoke out about her passionate nature, appearing on Good Morning Britain. Comparing her to Harry's late mother, he claimed, the problem is in my view that she is trying to be Diana. She's trying to adopt a new role, and the tragedy of the story is it'll end in the same way unless someone steps in from the palace and says look this is the way it's done here. Meghan has long been vocal of her stance on feminism, politics and human rights, as well as reportedly being against the royal annual Christmas shoot, due to the Duchess being an avid animal lover. At the end of last year H it was revealed Harry and Meghan would be moving out of their Kensington Palace cottage to the grounds of Windsor, to avoid their first child due in spring 2019, growing up in a goldfish bowl.